What is up YouTube, CirclePunk here from Play to Win Gaming. And yes, I do know it's been a while since I made a video. Uh, but to be honest, I've, I've kind of been not playing many video games lately. I've kind of been doing things in my real life. Uh, trying to take over a few things, uh, get a few things started. But yeah, uh, I don't know if you noticed in this video, I'm actually trying something new. I'm going to put some background music on it, so in case you get bored of the commentary or kind of drift off, you can just enjoy the music in the background. It's actually pretty cool. I'll leave a, a link to the uh, the person's YouTube channel and the music. It's actually a pretty cool, uh, pretty cool song. Uh, but yeah, here I'm bringing you some uh, Black Ops gameplay uh, demolition. Actually, the second half of it, because on the first half, I was basically rushing it myself, trying to plant the bombs, and I just got so many deaths doing that. So on uh, this one, I kind of just stood back and defended the uh, what's that? B B bomb, and uh, yeah. But uh, to be honest, I I, I kind of really, really digging Modern Warfare 3. Uh, it's just I don't know what it is. It just seems like boring, I guess. So I decided to slap in some Black Ops. You know, it's been a while since I played and. This is my first game I've had in a while, and actually I did pretty good. I'm using the, uh, what is that, the M14. It's actually pretty cool. It's a semi-auto. Uh, you can see how fast my freaking trigger finger is on it, which is pretty cool. Uh, but yeah, to update you guys on the channel, what's going on, uh, I do have a few ideas I want to throw out there. I do want to do the quick tip uh, series still, where I basically play like a game and do one video on it. Just like basic things I've learned about it or my opinion on it. Which is pretty cool, that's going to be coming up. Uh, I actually, I, even though I, I do feel Modern Warfare 3 is a little bit stale, uh, I want to get some footage of it. Uh, I, especially on um, survival mode, like some tactics and strategies to run, because that's actually pretty cool. I'm having uh, quite a bit of fun with that. And also some more Battlefield videos. Uh, I'm going to be going through maps and uh, maps, weapon layouts, and tactics on both Rush and Conquest. Uh, I do have a few ideas up down already. I'm actually, I do have a few videos of it too. I just have to finish editing and, and uh, putting them together. So that would be pretty cool. And also, I'm, I'm recently I've kind of gotten into the, the, the fighting genre of video games. Uh, I've been enjoying Marvel vs. Capcom. That one's actually pretty fun. I have part 2 and 3. I've been playing that a bit. Uh, probably throw some more, um, I guess, tip videos of those too, which would be pretty cool. And actually something that I realized, sorry to go off topic, but I, since I haven't played this game in a while, I never realized how, like, over, not overpowered, I guess, but useful uh, scavenger is. As you can see in this video, I keep picking up grenades and just keep checking them randomly trying to get somebody, which is pretty funny. Oh, and then this Claymore fail right there, black jacket, but I end up getting them anyways. But yeah, in Modern Warfare 3, it, um, scavenger it only seems to you pick up uh, ammo for your gun, which is kind of... Um, interesting. That's like a big change that you don't even pick up secondaries, which is a little odd. But yeah. well, anyways, uh, about the video. Uh, as you can see, I'm running UAV counter and uh, care package, which is not like a high kill streak. But I'm actually not really going for high kills on this game. I was actually just trying to uh, defend the objective, but my team was doing a horrible job. I don't know if you've seen earlier, but a guy managed to go around the corner and like. Two of my teammates were right behind him, and the guy took me out before they took him out, which was kind of a little irritating, but yeah, no noobs. But anyways, uh, what I actually wanted to talk about in this video is uh, lately, me and my friend, we had a, a discussion about uh, the Battlefield versus Call of Duty, and that how Battlefield 3 isn't perfect. Because as I was telling them, I had like I had issues with uh, Modern Warfare 3, but what I had said was that Battlefield 3 is actually running on a brand new engine so like it's ex kind of expected to have problems with it compared to Call of Duty when it's been using the same engine for about five years now so like I don't know what do you what do you guys think about that you think it maybe releasing a beta for Call of Duty would help it or hurt it or maybe just changing their engine altogether and making something fresh leave your comments below I really want to know what you guys think well, I do believe that will be all for today, guys. Uh, leave a like if you like, dislike if you dislike. Don't forget to subscribe. And uh, yeah, I'll leave you guys with the rest of the video and the music. Hope you guys enjoy.